Hello and welcome back to my series of Ultima 4 Quest of the Avatar. We are still here in Britain and that's because we still have things to do. Now we were able to bring Julia back to life. Uh, you'll see that our health is all topped off. I was able to hold up and rest off camera which is a good thing. But, uh, you know, there are things here that we haven't found yet. Uh, we've got the mantra. This is the town, being in Britain, the town of compassion. So we have the mantra of compassion, it being Mu, M-U. But we don't have the location of the shrine yet. We don't have the rune yet. Um, we do have the companion from here, which was Iolo. So we've, we've, we've checked that off, but I want to get those two, two missing pieces here so we can kind of, you know, check that off on, on our checklist of what we need to do in, in Britain. And then I would also, uh, we'll, we'll scoot over to, uh, Castle Britannia there and, or, or Lord Britain's castle, I guess that's what it's called and, or Lord British's castle. And we will talk to uh, the uh, maids that tells you how you're doing on your, on your things. And then probably we'll, if we get through all that and we find the shrine, we'll probably try to do some, some meditating. And then maybe we'll end up the episode by making our way back to Moonglow because we do need to get some uh, more reagents. We're getting a little low on spells. We're getting a little low on spells. But let's see if we can find out what we need here. Uh, mainly being the shrine and the rune. So we're going to have to talk to people, but we won't have to necessarily get super duper detailed with them because we have, um, you know, we have talked to them, most of them about things. Can you tell me anything about the shrine? Can you tell me anything about the rune? So I'm just going to kind of go through here real fast. Okay, you know nothing. I am Pepper. Oh, spicy woman. What do you know about the rune, Pepper? The rune of compassion lies at the end of the hall, end of a hall somewhere in this town. Ah, ha, ha. Okay, that is good news. I'm guessing you can't tell me anything about the shrine. Nope. Okay, so we need a hall. And then we probably got to search for it. Interesting. So let's ask this beggar. Be a chance to show compassion. Uh, let's see. Anything about the rune? I think we know where the rune is. Anything about the shrine? All right. Let's give 10 gold. Show how compassion, passionate we are. All right. Spirits, food, shrine. All right. You're no help. Drunk so confider. You're already drunk. I shouldn't have to. He turns away. Too drunk to talk to the likes of me. Thievel. Unfortunate name. What does you do here? I search for the ma the mystery of the magic orbs. Oh, I don't remember this. Orbs? A one-handed beggar knows their secrets. Okay. Hast thou seen him? Oh, so we need to look for a one-handed beggar. No, I have not seen him. Find him in Serpent Castle, for he knows of the orbs. Oh, that's a neat clue. I must have missed that last time. Okay, so we've heard about Serpent Castle before. That's way to the south in the Isle of Deeds. Um, that's supposed to be the third. You know, So we get Empath Abbey and we got the Lyceum. Uh, and um, Serpent Castle is supposed to be the third one of those kind of keeps toward one of the principles. Um, so, okay. So that's something else. Wow. We never knew that. So let's see. I must've missed this guy. Okay. Well, you've been most helpful, sir. Oops. Oh, I, I was looking at the wrong character. A bard in green. Um, shrine rune. All right. All right. I think I talked to everybody here and I'm trapped. Thank you for letting me out, you drunken louts. All right, so here is a hallway with a convenient looking nook. <laughs> we find the rune of compassion. Excellent. Let's talk to this guy. I am mentor. Can you tell me anything about the shrine? Nope. Job. Magencia. 
Typing, typing, typing. Magencia. Am I spelling that wrong? M A J E N. No, I'm spelling that right. Uh, what is it? Job escaped. All right. I guess you you just escaped and you're hiding out. Alrighty then. We don't need to we don't need to do that. So I still haven't gotten any clues about the shrine, about where the shrine might be. I wonder if we need to get that from the castle. Let's look around and make sure there isn't somebody I miss. It's in the outskirts here. A druid. Can't help me with the shrine. All right, let's talk to you. All right, you can't help me with that. I don't know that any of the kids, usually the kids don't have a whole lot of information. Nope. We got a couple frolicking down here. Yeah, you're worthless to me. That kid won't even talk to me. All right, no secret people here. These healing people, these probably are comatose. Yep. What's your name? Sebastian. Shrine. Job. What's your terrible secret? Mondane's influence has not left the world. Okay, that's interesting. I probably saw that before, but I didn't realize the significance. So last time we were told by Servile and Vesper that the skull of Mondane the wizard is an evil artifact. Uh, and so that's what this is referring to. Cool. All right. Uh, all right. So you can't help me with the shrine. Where is this bloody shrine? I don't think all you want to do is sell me stuff. Peace and joy. Are you in need of help? No, we're not in need of help. Uh, art thou willing to give 100 points of thy blood to aid others? That's interesting. So I lose 100 hit points. Sure, why not? Maybe it'll help my compassion score. So now I'm down to 300. May thy life be powers of good. Okay. Interesting. I don't know that I've gotten that before. Okay, so we've talked to you. Over here were the kids, and this is where we found Iolo. Charming Jester. Name. Gweno. So Lady Jester. Shrine. Cannot help me with the shrine. I'm wondering if maybe I need to go to Lord British. Maybe Lord British himself. Um, if nothing else, maybe somebody in the castle. Let's just kind of look at the outskirts here. But I think we've talked to everybody. Just kind of hanging, hanging, hanging a boot. Let's go up this way. Make sure there's not somebody... Nobody there, nobody there, just a guard. I wouldn't expect a guard is going to know. Cheerful guard. Name. I'm a guard. What is your job? I guard things. You know anything about the shrine? Nope. Okay. So, yeah, I think that's it. I think that's it. We've given blood. We've given money. I don't think I, any of these merchants, I can't. Yeah, all 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 the all they're there about is is their is their business. So they're not. Did I talk to you, sir? Drunken fighter. I think this is the guy that just turned away from me. All right, he can't help me with it anyway. Okay, let's head over to Lord British's castle, um, and see if there is. Wait a minute. What's this area here? Is this the entrance to that? Nothing, nothing, nothing. Okay, we'll head over to Lord British's castle. Let me talk to this guy real quick. Sabero, I just talked to you, I think. All right. I really don't want to fight you. <laughs> He'll be waiting for me when I get out. <laughs> so it doesn't really matter. Okay, so let's let's ask around here. Shrine. Nope. You're no help. Another onk. Onks are everywhere here. Alright, so this is... 
I'm sleeping. Okay. I think I gotta wait until I wake up. I will speak only with Gizmo. Return when Gizmo is revived. Right. So, because Julia is the only one awake right now. So, I'll just wait until I wake up here. All right. Welcome, Gizmo. I am Hawkwind, seer of souls. I see that which is within thee and drives thee to deeds of good or evil. For what path dost thou seek enlightenment? Well, we've done all three uh, cycles of meditation for sacrifice. So let's start there. Thy sacrifice is small. Give thy life's blood so that others may live. Okay. Well, I just gave 100 points. Maybe I need to do that more often. Hmm. All right. Um, we've also done some meditation at for justice. And not a, every beggar I've come across. Well, that's probably compassion. So never mind. Well, this is justice. Thou art cruel and unjust. In time, thy will suffer for thy crimes. What in the hell? <laughs> what have I done to be cruel and unjust? I am so confused. I am so confused. I don't understand. What? All I kill are people that try to kill me. Am I not supposed to like kill these rogues that are trying to kill me and you know orcs and stuff? I'm not like running around randomly killing people. All right. Um, let's see how I'm doing on honesty. Thou art not an honest soul. Thou must live to more uh, must live a more honest life to be an avatar. Okay. All right. Um, compassion. Thou dost show thy compassion well. Thank God. Continue goodwill should be thy guide. Okay, so I'm doing okay on compassion, with the giving of giving of 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 uh, you know, alms and and stuff to the um, to the bugger to to the beggars. Uh, thou art not yet a valiant warrior. Fight to defeat evil and prove thyself. All I am doing, Hawkwind, is fighting evil. All right, so let's see, this is a, a honor. Probably nothing on honor. We haven't gone to the city of honor yet. Thou dost not fight with honor, but with malice and deceit. Holy hell. I, I, I am so confused. Uh, spirituality. We don't haven't been to to the towns of, of of spirituality yet, so I'm guessing not much. Oh, I'm doing well on the path to inner sight. Continue to seek the inner light. Interesting. Humility. Thou dost seem a humble soul. Thou art setting strong stones to build virtues upon. Okay, so I'm like I'm like bipolar <laughs> or, or schizophrenic here i've got my i'm like i'm jekyll and hyde thou art cruel and unjust in time you will suffer for thy crimes holy heck <laughs> i'm so confused what am i doing that is cruel and unjust i mean the only people i've i've i i've I mean, if I just dump out of battles, then my Valor score takes a hit. What have I done that's unjust? What have I done that's cruel? I don't get it. Maybe maybe it's, maybe that's, you know, maybe that has to do with, we'll try this as a, as a strategy. Maybe both of these things, because I think um, uh, Valor took a hit too, right? Yeah. I don't know. Maybe, you know, so like when the orcs are fleeing and we've sometimes still shot at them to kill them, even though they're running away, maybe that's, maybe that's my problem. I, I'm reveling in blood too much. So we'll try, we'll try not doing that and see what that affects going forward. If they want to run away, we'll let them run away. We'll just chase them. Uh, okay. So we've seen how we've how we're going. We're a real mixed bag. 
Um, because I think I have to have I have to have good ratings in all eight of these things. This isn't a video game that allows you to do like an evil <laughs> an evil run through. You have to get high marks on all of these in order to complete the stinking quest. Okay, goodbye, Hawkwind. All right. Let's find some people to talk to and ask about the shrine. Oh, where'd he go? Burly guard. Shrine. You know, I think rather than talking to everybody and their cousin to start with, let's uh, start off by talking to Lord British. Because he may be the person that can that can help me. Welcome, Gizmo, and thy worthy adventurers. What would you ask of me? Can you tell me about the shrine? Ugh. I don't know why I'm asking about the rune. Okay. Um, Valor. Many valiant fighters come from Yehom and in the Valerian Isles. No, we haven't been to the Shrine of Valor yet. Maybe that's part of it. We haven't been able to make it to the Shrine of Valor yet. It's on an island that we don't have access to until we get a boat. Maybe that's it. Okay. Thank you. You've been no help. All right. Um, this is a lady, right? Fair Maiden. Shrine? Nope. Nope. Shrine. Nope. He won't talk to me. He's too busy playing. Playing his instrument to talk to the likes of me. All right. Prison. I don't think there was anybody here that I could talk to necessarily. I could jimmy these locks. I'm not sure how wise that would be. But now that I have keys, I do have the ability to jimmy these locks. Hmm. Hmm. Uh, you know, I, I don't, don't know that I'm really that interested in the mages, but the... Uh, or, or in the beggars, but the mages... Uh, and, you know, this person standing... This guard standing right there. So I would be... I would be doing it right in front of him and I'm not certain how he's going to take that I certainly don't want to get thrown into a cell with whatever the heck that is alright uh, bother alright let's keep looking around see who else we can ask uh, I don't know that I'm going to bother asking the guard so this is all that's here I think we got the guard room up here to the right I don't know this is like the kitchen or something I don't know. There's too many children everywhere. Yeah, this is the kitchen. These guys all had the same dialogue. I wouldn't expect a chef to know about this. Nope. And I wouldn't expect the kid to know about this. Yep, they won't even talk to me. All they will do is be in my way. Typical kids. All right, let's go back down to the first floor. guard room. Eh, I'm not going to bother talking to the guards. We've been all on this side. Let's look at the other side. This is the healer. I'm guessing, right? Heal. Okay. Well, let's talk to this bozo here. Maybe, if he stops dancing with me. Solemn Ranger. Name. Sheila. Job. I searched for the inner light. Seek in the shrines. Well, now we're getting somewhere. Runes are needed to enter shrines. Does that know the mantra? I do. Truthfully. This is honesty here. You listen in Hawkwind? I know the shrine. I know the, for, for compassion, I know the, uh, the mantra. In fact, the only mantras we're missing are the ones for the two, for honor and spirituality, for the two towns we haven't been to yet. Good. Okay. I need to know where the shrine is. Yeah, I know about the shrine. So the runes are needed to enter the shrines. So justice and sacrifice and now compassion. But I need to know 
I need to know where the stinking shrine is. All right. Is there anybody else that can help me? No. Huh. Well, we made us have to look for it. It should be in this general area. We made us have to go roaming around a bit and looking for it. In fact, I've got kind of a hunch. Oh, okay. Here we go. Um, I, I told you these guys would be waiting for us. All right, that guy's fleeing. Oh, Julia's got her mace, that's ridiculous. He's fleeing, but he's coming toward me. So now what am I supposed to do? I guess I'll come over here and I'll help Iolo. And then she needs to ready her sling. All right. Wow, we're really doing badly with our slings here. Okay, there we go. Barely wounded. That guy's dead. The guy that said he was fleeing doesn't seem to be really doing a good job of fleeing. Well, now maybe he's fleeing. He was just fleeing toward us, which seems ridiculous and stupid. Okay. I don't know what that sound was. Maybe somebody finally fleed and left the field of battle. Okay, barely wounded. All right, I'm gonna attack this guy that's in my face. So hopefully that wasn't the guy that was fleeing, but he did like come up to me. So that guy's fleeing. The guy at the top looks like he's fleeing. So that guy left. All right, so he's gone. So we'll chase this guy off. Let him live with his life. Get Iolo. 63 gold. All right. Um, let's hold up in camp. I want to get my health back up. Ooh, and we made it without we made it without uh, getting attacked. Okay, so I, my my hunch is is over here. We saw this because the moon gate's over here. There is a bridge, and I'm curious if maybe the shrine might be over here someplace. So let's just kind of look around. I'm expecting to be somewhere nearby. So we're just gonna reconnoiter the area, if you will and see what we can see. We're kind of within this little mountain range. And these orcs are gonna want some special pummeling. All right, guys, you wanna move in the position for me? All right, thank you. I love orcs that are polite and do what I tell them to do. That guy's heavily wounded. Now he's fleeing. So we'll leave him be. It's easier with two of them. Although he's once again fleeing in our direction. All right, now he's going off to the side. He's heavily wounded. Get him, Julia. Okay, good. She got some experience. That's excellent news. All right, we'll chase this guy off. All right, good. Get and I'll let you do that Iolo. 93 gold, nice. Oh boy, wow, there's lots of people out today. I'm not finding what I wanna find in the least, because I think if we go head back over here, we're gonna hit Lord British's castle again. Oh, but first, we've got these guys to deal with. All right, well, you're not lined up to anything. Heavily wounded, good. heavily wounded still I'm really liking the sling as, as, a, as a weapon and I, my hope was because I think uh, Julia has probably got the best strength of any of us 
since she's you know technically a mace wielder, um, that she could throw the stones a little bit a little bit uh, harder than perhaps myself and Iola might. Now after this we have a real fight because we've got that Cyclops that's waiting that's waiting for us impatiently for us to get done. Man, these guys are just like crawling all over us. Heavily wounded. Gone. Barely wounded. I'm going to get this guy off the side. He's fleeing now. Run away. I will let you run away. Lightly wounded. Still lightly wounded. That guy's fleeing now. Iolo's guy's fleeing. Okay, our guy is still at it. All right, we're missing. So he's dead. Iolo's guy is running away, so I'm just gonna let him run away. Oh, crap. That was not what I wanted to do, so he's fleeing. All right, we will let him. I thought you were fleeing. You wanna flee, flee. I guess because I got up next to him, which is, I wasn't, that wasn't my intention to begin with. All right, so we did kill one guy there that because that was, that was a mistake on my part. All right. Can I get this before we have to deal with Mr. Cyclops? 42 gold. Three of them. Okay. Ugh. <laughs> All right. Cast. Fireball. I think I've only got three of these. All right. So that leaves two. Um... We gotta wait for these guys to kind of line up for us. Which they don't really have to do because they got they can fr freaking throw rocks. I hate these guys. I hate these guys. Okay, so now I can attack with the sling. Heavily wounded. And I uh, okay, that guy lined up for Julia too. Heavily wounded. Let's finish these guys off. We're missing Julia. Oh, critical. Excellent. Probably one more hit all, is all he needs. That guy's fleeing. But yet he's still throwing stuff at me. I'm going to move us just so we don't accidentally hit him. All right, they're both fleeing. If you're fleeing, flee. I'm just going to kind of move out of the way here and, and kind of entice them to, uh, to continue fleeing. And maybe we can get behind these rocks. I can't do anything with her. Come on, dude. If you're going to flee, flee. If you're not going to flee, then we're going to... Okay, now he's fleeing. He just had to look all manly and throw stuff at us. And 92 gold. All right, we're getting our gold supply back up here, which is good. All right, so I think we're actually... Have come... Yeah, okay, so there's Britain and all that. So, yeah, I am not at all certain... The shrine doesn't seem to be in the general area here. So, oh, skellies. Oh, and a mage. Oh, dear. Okay. I'm going to have to use another one of my fireballs. We'll have to wait on that. First, we've got to get these skellies out of here. That skeleton was fleeing, so I will let that flee. Although, I don't know how it could be inhuman to a skeleton. That seems, by definition, oh my lord, can we like hit something please? Clear the path so I can get all fireball-y on this guy's butt. All right, cast fireball north. Wow, that was easy, okay. I didn't expect that to go quite so fast. All right, let's let these guys move into position. I like that we've got uh, Julia sandwiched in between us because uh, she's got the lowest health. So, oh, that guy. Oh, that guy's fleeing. Okay, he's still fleeing. We'll let him flee. All right. Okay, good. So you can run away. Okay, good. Iolo. Okay. All right, so what I think we're going to do, besides ignore the sork. All right, now I'm 
where did Brit, where did Britain's castle go again? There it is. All right. So what I think we're going to do is we are going to head to Moonglow because we are uh, definitely in out of stuff. But I think we will do that in the next episode because I am at the half an hour mark. So I would like to thank you for um, joining me for this episode. I do hope you will come back for the next one. And until then, be seeing you.